All right, I decided to do a follow-up video because I missed a few points yesterday with my why net neutrality is good that it's getting repealed. Well, the way net neutrality worked because it got repealed today is that it treated all bandwidth the same. So if I'm viewing a web page, that's viewed the same as if someone's watching a high definition video on Netflix. All the bandwidth is the same and even though one is using more than the other, it has to be treated as the same. So repealing that is going to require, well, it's not gonna require, but it's gonna eventually end up that Netflix is gonna have to pay for their fair share since they're using more bandwidth than say me looking at a web page on Yahoo or Google or something. And the same thing goes with YouTube. You know, viewing a web page and watching something in 4K is obviously a huge difference. And the cost is gonna end up on the, uh, the big companies on the internet, not us. It's not gonna allow the ISPs to block web pages or slow web pages down. It's going to open up the free market so that, you know, these companies can start paying a premium to the to like AT&T or Comcast. I'm talking about Netflix and YouTube and those kinds of companies. It's going to make them pay their fair share. That's a that's a word that Democrats like to use with uh, rich people, fair share. Well, it applies this same way. Bandwidth won't be treated the same because not all bandwidth is the same. Viewing a web page and viewing a high definition video or streaming it are obviously two different things. And it's not going to censor the internet, like I said yesterday with my video yesterday. It's not going to censor the internet. It's just going to make it so that the ones that are using the higher bandwidth, the big Netflix, YouTube, video websites, they have to pay more to the ISP, AT&T, Comcast, or, you know, another one of the ISP providers. Uh, I don't know all of them. It's going to make them pay them money, not, not our ISPs charging us. It's very, very, very unlikely that they would come to the u the consumer before they came to the the company that was actually requiring the bandwidth. So, just clearing that up. That's what this means today.